Eddie's Grunts Executive Jespin Jr. 98 here with another tutorial. And today's tutorial we have how to install Paint.net and also install plugins. As you may be wondering, what this is so random. Why are you making this video? And it's a simple answer. In my how to make a banner video, a lot of people were questioning how to install plugins and where did I get my plugins. So if that was your case, this is the video for you. Before we get started, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe for more Pokemon tutorials and or any type of Pokemon graphic video in the future. So anyways, let's get started. The first thing you're going to need is to go into your browser. Uh, you can use Firefox or Night Explorer, which is, I don't understand why people still use that, or Chrome, which is what I'm using, and you're going to go to www.getpaint.net. So that is where you get, this is the official website of Paint.net, so there won't be no viruses and stuff like that. So what you're going to need to do is do not click any of these because obviously you can tell these are ads just by the simple fact that when you touch them both of them get light a lot of people fall for the trick that they see a button that says download and they just click that automatically another way you can tell this is obviously an ad is because right here there's a little x and ad choices basically it reveals it's an ad so we can just cover and there you go you won't be sh you won't, you won't be seeing it anymore so that's good but the actual link you guys are going to need is this one right here so you click on that and um, you just basically click on download now after you click on download now you can click on right here which I am not going to do because I already have paint on that installed but after that you will it will basically ask you to install open administrator and blah 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 now the part you guys are probably here for are the plugins and this is and yet another forum of the official paint on it page so I will post a link of both of these um, websites so you guys can go check so the recommended which I use are first one and second one let's click on this one and see what it has so it has curves board and shapes gradient bars outline object which was one that you guys asked me splatter pixelate all of these are really good really 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 good um, plugins so what you can do is you can either click right here or right here we're gonna click on this one on the bottom they are all the same as you guys can see it's gonna be right here and um, once you have it downloaded let's actually put this in our desktop and you're gonna have to unzip this I'm guessing many of you guys will already have one bar so as you can see there's a lot of these things and you guys are probably saying what in the hell is this so it's very simple make sure you get rid of these license things and how to install because I this is what I'm here for so you can organize these or you can just select them all I'm gonna organize them just so I, I can get all of them at one go as you can see right here so once you're the once you are here, excuse me, you are. It all depends on what Windows you have. If you have Windows 7 or if you have Windows 8, it might be a bit different. But I'll show you the way for Windows 8. So you can either click on your home menu, which I don't like because I don't like Windows 8 like this. But I know it's just what it is. But we can. The easiest way to do this is to go to your um, folders. And then after doing this, you are going to go to C, which is your computer. Then you're going to go to Program Files. And right here where it says Paint.net, if you are installing effects, you're going to have to click on this effect folder and you select everything select everything and we're gonna drag it not to when it's just where it says move to effects and it's gonna tell me replace these files in the destination and I'm gonna say no you know let's put re replace files and continue this is basically I already have them which is why it's asking me to replace so we can just throw that away and basically that is pretty much it however 
you could um have some difficulties because some of them aren't actually effects they're actually like as in here and play down there let me open and give an example of what i am saying because many of you guys are saying what in the hell is this guy saying and i'm going to prove to you guys or not prove but i'm going to show you guys what i'm talking about so as you can see right here effects you can see way more options that you had before because I don't believe render was one of those and right here render you can get all of these effects some of them come in that plugin some of them come in the other one but another thing which is why I am saying that you guys should definitely check what it is if it's not an effect you can just regularly drop it into paint on that and right here an adjustment something that you guys will definitely want to get is this one it basically colors your paper whatever color you want and that's really good because there's no other tool that does that except for the paint bucket and when you're typing in stuff and you actually want to do paint bucket as you guys can see let's press control X and tell me explain to you guys what I mean so let's type in random words right so you see I'm tapping random words let's make it white now let's say oh we wanted to color yellow so you're going to have to press shift to it um, selects everything but as you can see it does have like these extra borders and those do not look good at all and to fix that all literally all you have to do is go to this this and see there's no borders as they were before which is really good it makes it look more smoother and clean so there you guys have it how to install plugins and try to make it as fast as possible make sure you guys hit that like button and go check out my channel in the link in the description and I'm out Go to see that I wouldn't make it now they don't want saying congrats, kid. Used to keep money that I made from hustling.